financially able validating research findings that were carried out um, the spatial mapping report for persons with albinism. It's an interesting day, one, to get back to the community, to tell them what we found out, but more so they attest to the truth that we did good work and indeed the findings are true. What has come out clearly today is 69% of people that were interviewed did not know about albinism. Uh, the problem we have in the change of job and in Uganda as a whole, we have little data on, uh, on uh, albinos. So uh, uh, the situation in Chenduji is like other, other districts in the, in, the, in the country. But uh, specifically for Chenduji, we have only two learners with, with albinos in the schools. But the community does not want uh, a person with albinism. When you make a business, Sometimes you find the people in the community they doesn't want to 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 buy something from you or to to come to to come to you because because of your skin. Most of the people think the mothers did something wrong. Others think it is witchcraft. Others think the mother ate bad food. But according to science, it is a reaction in the body. We have to sensitize our people because it is their right to live. And we are going to use our cultural heads like the kings and the chiefs and the clan leaders because that's our network in the cultural institutions and down to the grassroots. <laughs>